Hi, everyone. This is Dr. Palacios, and I am here to continue answering your questions regarding migraines. In today's episode, we're going to just briefly talk about a pharmaceutical drug called Amovig or Enerumaf. So the question is like this. So I've been using Amovig for the past three months and I've noticed an incredible improvement in my migraines. But I have noticed since using Amovig that my joints are stiff and ache all over. Could you comment on that? Most certainly I can. And this is going to help us explore on the mechanism of action of Amovig and the profile side effects that this drug can have. Now, Amovig is a type of drug that is used in the prevention of migraine headaches by blocking a compound called CGRP or, or calcitonin gene receptor peptide. Now this type of peptide or molecule tends to ignite or activate a migraine headache by causing vasodilation, which are the blood vessels in the head that allows them to expand. So that is the beginning of the migraine. Now, this drug inhibits those receptors because those molecules, CGRP, they trigger the pain signals. And the clinical studies show that it is effective in two studies that are shown in the website of amobic.com. Now, the first one is a three-month study of chronic migraineurs that they administered this medicine over the period of three months. And they found out that many of them had seven or fewer days episodes of migraines. In another study of six months of episodic migraineurs, which are about 14, four to 14 days of migraine episodes a month, they have seen three to four day average of less episodes. So we do see that there is effectiveness in the drug. Now, what about the safety profile? What are about some of the side effects that we could talk about? And these are three main side effects that have been explained in the website. The first one is injection site inflammation. So because Amovig is a monoclonal antibody, you need to inject it. So at the site of injection, it will leave a little bit of inflammation and that's normal. It should resolve in a couple of days. The next side effect to keep in mind is constipation. And then the last major side effect to keep in mind is high blood pressure. If you suffer high blood pressure, you're probably not going to be recommended this drug because it can raise the blood pressure. Also, if you're taking the drug and your high blood and your blood pressure starts to increase, make sure you tell your doctor about that. And you also got to remember that all of the side effects that you experience taking this type of drug, you should report it to the website or to the FDA which I will leave a link recorded on the bottom. So you can click it and provide your information. That way they have more information and provide a wider umbrella of side effect profile. Now, achy joints and feeling pain over the body, it's common in a type of monoclonal antibody because after all, they are autoimmune triggers. So there could be an autoimmune episode that could be happening. In a naturopathic tenant of the healing power of nature, we believe that the body needs its nutrients, needs its nutrients and its vitamins and its support to detoxify the organs and help the organs detoxify the pharmaceuticals that are providing a high amount of stress. And this tends to happen with people who take lots of different medication and they don't give the, time, the body time to rest. The more common places of detoxification include the liver, the kidneys, and the lungs. And believe it or not, the skin is a great way to also detoxify things. And if you'd like to work together and address the root causes of your migraines, please click on my bio link below. And we can also find alternative ways to your migraines and other conditions as well. And it's all at the comfort of your home. Thank you so much and have a great rest of your day.